Hi, I'm Colin from Spaceflight Made Simple, and today I want to bring you guys a quick video about tomorrow's Falcon 9 launch. Falcon 9 will be carrying the Cargo Dragon on the CRS-21 resupply mission to the International Space Station. This mission will launch from Launch Complex 39A at the Kennedy Space Center in Florida. T-0 for this launch is set for 11.39 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on Saturday, December 5th, 2020. Three seconds before T-0, the nine engines on the first stage of the Falcon 9 will be ignited, and at T-0, the rocket will lift off the pad. At a little over two minutes into flight, the first stage will have finished its role in sending this mission to the International Space Station, at which point it will separate from the upper stage and head to the drone ship, of course I still love you, to attempt to land. Meanwhile, the second stage will continue on towards orbit. And about nine minutes after liftoff, the second stage engine will cut off and the spacecraft will be in orbit. Shortly after the second stage engine cuts off, the spacecraft will separate from the second stage and begin making its way to the International Space Station. Docking with the International Space Station is scheduled for roughly 24 hours later, with the docking planned to happen at around 11.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on Sunday, December 6th. Cargo Dragon will approach the International Space Station from above and dock with the pressurized mating adapter mounted to the top of the Harmony module. Unlike the previous version of Cargo Dragon, this version will dock to the space station using its own thrusters as opposed to relying on the robotic arms mounted to the space station. Once it is docked, the crew on the space station will begin the process of equalizing the pressure between the Cargo Dragon and the space station, and then they will eventually open the hatch and begin removing the supplies and experiments that have been sent up on board this vehicle. Now you may notice that this design is different from the previous version of Cargo Dragon, and it looks a whole lot like Crew Dragon or Dragon version 2. That is because the new version of Cargo Dragon that will fly from now on is based off of the Crew Dragon. As such, it has all of the same capabilities as Crew Dragon, being able to launch at rendezvous with the International Space Station completely autonomously, and at the end of the mission, return home to splash down in the ocean, bringing scientific experiments back to Earth. So if you want to watch this launch live, I'll leave some links down below that can help you with that. First off, I'll leave a link down below to NASA and SpaceX's YouTube channels where they'll be live streaming the launch and the docking. And I'll also leave a link to my Twitter where I'll post up-to-date information on this mission as well as other upcoming events in spaceflight. And if you have any questions about Falcon 9, Cargo Dragon, or CRS-21, leave them down below in the comments and I'll try my best to answer them down there. And last but not least, if you enjoyed this video, head down below, hit the like button, the subscribe button, and the bell icon so you get notified when I upload new videos. So for Spaceflight Made Simple, I'm Colin and I will see you next time. 